So I friend, this is Amit and you are watching my channel information and educational video. So here I will talk about JMIN 2022 June 24 shift 1. As you all know today the shift 1 is already done now. So here I am with the marks versus percentile of that that is what you can expect and already I have provided you the difficulty level it is the complete review of the shift 1 of JMIN's 2022 paper. So please try to watch that video also so that you will be able to know which type of paper was there from which chapter more question we are asked subject wise I have discussed everything. So here I am with the shift 1 marks versus percentile. So if you have appeared in this shift, you can relate what type of percentile you are going to get based on the marks that you are expecting from your examination. And also similar type of information I will be providing you for shift 2 and, and for all the day that is tomorrow, day after tomorrow and for all the shift of JMS 2022, I will be providing you the review as well as marks versus percentile data so that you can estimate yourself which type of percentile you are going to get based on your examination. So if you are first to my channel, please try to subscribe to the channel so that you will be getting all the updates about JMS, JE Advance as well as other entrance exam, other counseling also in the same channel and up, and up to your admission is done i will be guiding you and providing you all the update at the right time so please try to subscribe and also one more very important information that is expected cutoff for je advanced category wise that is minimum mark that you need to have in order to be eligible for je advanced examination i will be talking that also in the same video so let's get started with the marks versus percentile data so here is the information i don't want to waste your time that's why i'm going straight away to the marks versus percentile information that is for 99.9 .9 you uh, for 99.9 .9, your marks should be around 230 plus marks and and how was the paper for difficulty level for that i have already provided the video that is complete review and analysis of the paper of shift one you can check that video in the i button as well as the description box so here is the information for 99.8 percentile your marks should be around 222 and for 99.6 your marks should be 214 and for 99.4 your marks should be above or equal to 202 or and for 99 your marks would be 191 and for 98 one, 170 paper was a little bit tricky so it will have the effect on marks versus percentile as well and also the students are from purely covid affected batch so many students will not able to score more marks in the examination due to the lack of preparation so that's why all those things i have considered and also i have considered the feedback from the student that i have got and i have already provided those feedback in the previous video so for 98 170 marks and for 97 155 marks and for 96 130 marks for 90 95 118 plus marks for 93 108 and for 90 98 marks will be required for 85 90 marks for 80 82 marks will be required so one more information i would like to provide you here that is if you want complete and personal guidance for all the counseling whatever you will do including josa and csf counseling you can contact me through instagram or whatsapp number so that i will be guiding you to get the best in all the counseling and i can assure you by the end of this year admission season you will be in the best college with best brand so if you want you can contact me through instagram or whatsapp number available in the description box so let's continue this that is for 75 your marks would be 74 for 70 percentile your marks would be 67 or more and for 65 your marks would be your marks would be 60 or more and for 60 percentile your marks would be 55 plus and for 50 46 plus and for 40 percentile your marks would be around 34 marks so this was about the marks versus percentile particularly for shift 1 24 june similar type of information i will be providing you for other shift also that is for the session 1 of jmins 2022 and later for session 2 as well so now let's talk about the expected cut of marks for J advance before that i would like to inform you if you are a pwd student you can check the pwd playlist or for any other student also there are lots of information available in this channel that is nit cut off safe marks safe percentile safe rank for iit how much marks you should get in J advance so everything has been discussed and for other in entrance exam also you will get the information so please try to go to the channel playlist so oh, yeah. now I would like to introduce the Philo app where you can get the solution of all your questions, doubt or you have problem with any type of concept related to J or NEET or boards examination. Then you can get the solution 24 by 7 with these three easy steps. That is first you have to download the Philo app in the play store and then you have to do the sign up process using your mobile number and after that take the photo of your question and upload that in the app. And after that within 60 seconds you will be connected to the India's best educator. Okay, question mein aap na, kehna hai ki bulb ki power kitni hai, agar bulb jo hai. वो 220 वोल्टेज पर ऑपरेट हो रहा है राइट इस बैटरी का जो वोल्टेज है वो आपको गिवन है 220 तो ये आपको सिंपल रिलेशन हो गया यहां पर अब अगर कोई आपको और डाउट है तो बताइए सो विदाउट वेस्टिंग योर टाइम डाउनलोड द फिलो ऐप लिंक इज अवेलेबल इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स एंड यूज द कोड IEB001 यू विल गेट द 10% इंस्टेंट डिस्काउंट सो हियर इज द इंफॉर्मेशन दैट इज फॉर जनरल कैटेगरी 93 टू 100 मार्क्स विल बी रिक्वायर्ड इन दिस शिफ्ट पार्टिकुलरली टू बी एलिजिबल फॉर द जी एडवांस एग्जामिनेशन एंड फॉर EWS 58 टू 65 
OBC 6267. One more thing I would like to inform you here that is percentile will remain same. That is the cutoff percentile will remain same, but the marks that you need to have to get those percentile that will vary depending on the difficulty level of the paper. So for SC category 40 to 45, in some uh, other shift you, you may have to score 50 marks. In some more hard shift you may have to score 35 marks. So it depends on the difficulty level of the paper. So I am providing you the data relevant to shift 1 only. For shift 2 and for other days I will be providing you similar information in the same channel. So for ST category 28 to 33 marks and for PWD there is no cutoff at any marks. I think if you will solve any one question you will be eligible for J advanced examination because the reservation is more. So this was all about the marks versus percentile and safe mark to get the eligibility for J advanced examination. So hope you find this information very useful. So please try to subscribe this channel so that you will be getting all the update about J means J advanced and other entrance exam other counseling also in this same channel. Thanks.